Uh, hello, everyone. This is Aya. I'm a senior developer in the community team. And uh, in this sprint, we have applied some uh, changes to the UX pages. We have updated uh, them with uh, some different uh, images from our recent uh, model mode. And we have also worked on um, fixing uh, the footer was cut off in some uh, smaller screens. So this is now fixed. And uh, as early mentioned, we have uh, implemented a new static page to uh, mitigate the DDoS, uh, DDoS attacks. Uh, as for the plugins directory improvements, we are still working towards our goal uh, of achieving a more user-friendly interface for the plugins directory. Uh, so in past sprints, we have showed you the changes to searching, filtering, and categorization. And today, on behalf of uh, Victor, I will show you a new feature, which is the pagination which was uh, highly requested from uh, a lot of users while we were doing our uh, user research. Um, so uh, the pagination um, is now, uh, uh, will be available uh, very soon on the, on the site. And um, if I can share my screen, I don't know if I can. Okay, so um, as you can see here, instead of the old show more button we had in the plugins directory, we now have um, pagination, which will make navigating the plugins directory easier and uh, much more efficient. So uh, let's take a quick example here. If I searched in a certain category, for example, activities in, let's say, model uh, version 4.1, and I search for plugins called grades, here I have like 34 plugins, and I can um, check all of them, and then I can navigate to the second page, and there was also here a scroll to top link, which will take me to the top of the page if I want to um, do more searches. And um, here also we added a share your feedback link for the users to share their opinions with us on the uh, recent updates. And um, there will be more changes to the plugins directory soon, which we believe will enhance uh, the user experience more. And that's it for me. Yeah, thank you, Aya. Um, I am Federico, a UX designer in the community team. Um, and I actually, just before going to the next slide, um, just wanted to share that uh, these changes are now live, uh, but not the pagination, but will be soon. But we are gathering feedback from uh, users through the forums and through that survey that we have live on the site. So we can like keep improving. There's still a few, we create a few tickets that we're going to be working on, like uh, improving the categorization and also improving um, a few things more on the site to be sure that these changes is, um, is addressing all user needs. And we're, because we're aiming to make uh, the site more usable for different roles. So um, we have, we had also previously the, the plugin type filter. So we, it's accessible now, but through the blog drawer. So we're working on this. So on also any developer who wants to access to any plugin type can access um, as well. But basically, there's a few changes. Um, um, we're working right now on the LTI uh, project for to bring LTI in the plugin directory. And uh, there's a few things that um, we are creating a proposal that comes from the research that we interviewed uh, the users. So all the research has been like um, addressed and analyzed. So we have a few things that we are going, uh, we're creating proposals on the site. Um, for example, we have here the screenshot to register an LTI tool. Um, and also we will have uh, a way to identify um, LTIs inside the plugins directory. So we will have plugins and we will have LTIs. We will, we will add like a little um, tag also on the card. So users can, um, so users will know that we have uh, new LTIs on the site. Um, so you can see also there is a little call to action that is called to, is to register a new LTI tool. Uh, and it will take us to uh, to basically a form that we are right now um, kind of setting the scope of it, setting all the fields and uh, kind of addressing the technical part of it to see how it would look. But we have uh, some designs that uh, the next step will be to uh, run some usability testing with these designs with the same users that we interview and, and potentially more users from different roles. Um, so we can be sure that uh, it's usable and it's it, the LTAs are shown in the best way possible on the site. So we can start addressing this, this new technology. Um, so yeah, this is in terms of LTI and the design, that's me.